my name is Amy and I have trigeminal neuralgia. It took quite a while to come to this diagnosis. Um, I had a lot of pain in my face. It's kind of like an ice pick to the face and I saw a lot of different doctors not in Rochester before I ended up at the Mayo Clinic. I saw a dentist, I saw ear doctors, I saw family practitioners. And finally, my ear doctor said, you have exhausted our resources here in Duluth, and I think you should go to the Mayo Clinic and see a neurologist. So that's how I ended up at Mayo. And I got a great neurologist who diagnosed me with trigeminal neuralgia, which I had never really heard about before, because it's a rare condition. Um, I wrote a book about it, and after talking with um, a neurologist and a neurosurgeon and trying a couple different medications, we decided that surgery was the best option for me. So I had um, something called a microvascular decompression where they actually drilled a hole into my skull and uh, removed blood vessels from the trigeminal nerve, put Teflon between them. And this was successful, which is really amazing. And I had the surgery probably two months ago, and I'm feeling great. The pain in my face is completely gone. However, today I just got diagnosed with another neuralgia in my ear. So it looks like I'm going to have to have surgery again in the near future. But I have a lot of confidence in the doctors that are treating me here. Um, I kind of have a team of doctors in the ear department, ear, nose, and throat department, and the neurology department, and I just feel like I'm in great hands here, and I, I trust them to uh, kind of lead me in the right path, whether it be surgery or medication. I feel comfortable talking to them about uh, these kind of rare conditions that not many people know about. Uh, my neurosurgeon today said you know, I have had no patients with this particular neuralgia before so I'm gonna go talk to my colleagues and uh, they all work together to figure out a solution or what the next step is for me.